Hello, my name is Edgar. Core by Premier Software now has the option to run what is known as a performance report. This report is useful to measure revenue generated, revenue forecasted for a set period, and general business activity compared to the previous year. Therefore, today I'll be showing you how to run a performance report using Core. First, log into Manager if you are a single site business, or Administrator if your business is based across multiple sites. To access the performance report, head to the general section on the main screen. Then click on the reports icon. In the All Reports tab, scroll down the list until you locate the Statistics subheader. At the very bottom of this, you will see the performance report. If you don't see this for any reason, this may not be active for your account yet. You can activate this as shown in our Activate New Update Features video. Click the performance report to highlight it. You will then be presented with several options to the right. Under the Sites section, you can use the drop down menus to select the regions you would like to run a report for, such as the UK. You can then select any sites if you have multiple business sites. You can also add any sites to the selection using the ellipsis to the right if you so wish. Under the Date section, you can use the applicable drop down to select a period to run the report for. For example, you may wish to run the report for last month or last year in this case. You can also select Custom to manually enter a date range. It is worth noting that you can run this report for past dates or even future dates to forecast future statistics. Select any specific staff member you would like to run a report for, otherwise leave this as All Selectable. You can also select if you would like to run the report on specific business areas such as your spa area, leisure area or memberships. Similarly, you can select a room and facility or leave these as All Selectable. The Include area will list several options you can use to generate specific business segments. For example, you may wish to include the payee type in the report, which will list all associated figures against the corresponding payee type, such as member, resident, client, company, till sale, etc. Similarly, packages will provide the number of packages booked and associated revenue. Other will provide details on all other spends, including deposits, memberships, cancellation charges, and so on. Each section will provide further breakdowns in their area when you run the report, such as memberships providing a breakdown of each membership via renewal, upgrade, downgrade, and cancelled members. Make sure you select the Detail checkbox before running the report to provide even further detail for each selected option. This will also break the details down by each day, otherwise they will show per month by default. When you're ready, click the Printer button to produce a digital report. You'll now see the report details broken down per each category. Use the arrows to find the information you need. You can then examine the report, save a digital copy using the usual options in the top left, or print paper copies as necessary. Now you know all the details of the new performance report. If you have yet to experience Core by Premier Software, why not book a free presentation using the link in the description. In the meantime, you can find out more when you visit our website at www.premier-core.com. Telephone our sales team on plus 44015434665850 or email us at sales at premiersoftware.co.uk. Why not subscribe to us on YouTube for weekly videos on how to use Core and click the notification bell to receive updates as soon as they become available. You can also follow us on Twitter at Core by Premier and LinkedIn at Premier Software Solutions for regular content. Take care and thank you for watching.